Hi everybody, my name is Aztec Alien, and welcome back to the shore. I have no idea what's happening right now. It looks like the little pedestal thingy kind of like reverted back to the original part that happened when I first released it. But um, cause last time I thought it was a lot closer than this. I mean, it's definitely getting closer, but I don't really have any idea of where to go or what to do now. Um, There's some purple goo over there, but we can't get past it because of this. There's also um, another one on that side that we can't get past either. Hey buddy, what's up? Ooh. So I don't really know what to do to progress, so I guess we're just gonna look around and see and find stuff and... Oh my gosh, the sensitivity on this mouse right now is insane. Okay, so I guess we'll wait, we'll see what this dude does. And we'll go from there. Oh, I just wondered. So, silly enough, I don't know if we can do this or not because it's technically a broken door, but there is a door downstairs right in front of the cellar. Down here. So maybe that has something to do with the key. So let's go see if we can get into the cellar thing. I don't know where his intended purpose is, but he is going and so are we. Probably to view horrible, dastardly things. Oh, I can hear him stompy stomping out there. Look at him. So this is what I was talking about. So, oh. <sighs> okay, then yeah, it does work. Oh, I thought it was literally a door that was ripped off of something and just thrown. It is not. Okay, you're doing your tippy tappy thing? Okay, I guess we're gonna go down here then. Oh my god, I'm sidestepping. Oh, sweet Jesus, it got so dark. <gasps> oh, I'm like, why did it make that weird noise? Oh no. Oh, please, no. Oh, good God. That is a petrified body. Freaking hell. Please don't How do did they manage to let him die in here? What made them forsake their civil ways? I don't know. Okay, we're gonna get closer to you. Please relax. <laughs> huh. I hide. No. <laughs> I had to hide. I had to. I ran. I climbed the rocks and tried to hide. That's when I fell into a pit full of dead bodies. Ooh. Their flesh looked rotten but petrified, as if their soul sucked dry out of them. The horrors in their faces touched the very void in my soul expressions as something horrific happened to them that's when the rest of the crew caught me they stripped me naked and they locked me down here they accused me that i was the one that brought the bad luck onto them by placing these tal talismans for them and blocking the pathways all i wanted was to keep them safe despite their uncivilized behaviors Ooh. <laughs> do you have anything else on you okay there's that oh oh this is pleasant you poor man I am so sorry. Okay, what's in here? Am I gonna get locked in here? That seems very unfortunate. Okay. Ooh, you poor dude. Please don't get up. Please don't get up. Please don't get up. Please don't get up. Oh! Oh, I thought it was a hand reaching out. Okay, um... No? Okay. Alright. Uh, what's this mean? Nothing? Cool. Okay. Oh, I'm so sorry, dude. Please don't get up. So we got the last chess piece. So we'll... Oh. I wondered what the hell that was. Why would you want to go up there? Is there anything up there that's important? Oh, okay, so he's almost where that one creepy thing was. Where are you going, my dude? What's happening? What what are you trying to do? Why would you want to go up there? Oh, hey. Hey, buddy. How you doing?
<gasps> what? What? Find the missing piece? Oh, okay. Did I not need to do this? Was this just a random thing? Oh my god. Well, what do we do now? Is there something I missed down here? Oh, <laughs> we're on top of it? Okay, get up. Oh. <gasps> oh. Okay, so the, yes, there was something I missed over here. I don't know what that has to do with anything, but okay. Ooh, can I use this coin thingy to open the doors? Or the gateways? Can I? <gasps> I can. Uh, ooh. Huh. I kind of regret doing that. I'm glad I double checked that though, because... What are you? Hmm. Hmm. Mm, okay. Because we As would a have been... young boy, I remember my father talking about this island. Mm -hmm. He described it in a way that would scare the listener. He spoke of black butterflies, corpse oh. candles, Ooh. and broken compasses. Yeah, there's a dead shark over there. That's interesting. His voice did scare the living crap out of me, but that is all right. Okay. Hello. Talk to me. Day five. There was a man aboard named Alan who went missing after we shipwrecked. One night, we found him walking alone across the beach. As we approached him... To our surprise, we saw that he had this fixed expression on his face, as if he had seen something horrifying. His hands... His hands and arms were paralyzed in a position like if he was protecting himself from something. We tried to ask him questions, but he didn't reply. Now he's sitting by the shore, singing songs to the rocks about reflections in the sea. Oh no... I wonder what he saw. I don't want to know what he saw. I was expecting to look up. I thought I saw something floating in the water. And I don't think I was. I think it was just the reflections of things, but it, did. it looked like something floating in the water. <laughs> We're gonna move on. There you go. Notice that I'm not running anymore. <laughs> now this is new territory, and I'm scared. That is a that is a big ass shark, my dudes. Oh, that looks like a giant shell. That middle rock there? Maybe we won't go up there. <laughs> Music change and I'm suddenly not wanting to. This island feels like it's maintained. Untouched by time. Mm -hmm. The wind and the waves pause for a minute to rest. The calm before the storm. Okay, come on, dude. Just shush. Still moving in the distance. It is still moving in the- Look at him! He's moving! <laughs> I'm sending this message as a cry for help. May the waves of the sea be kind. The pollen and I are castaways. Trying to find where this island is on the map. This doesn't make any sense. The sun is setting in the east. And the fog won't allow us to see through the scope that far. The odds are against us. There's something strange about Apollon. He keeps going on about <clears throat> how he's reliving this moment. I noticed how much he scratches the back of his head. It's gotten to the point where his hair is beginning to fall out. Yee. If you are reading this, <laughs> we need your help. So, it, it, like, I just had a thought. Like, I started scratching the back of my head, too, because my head itched and stuff. And I'm just like, oh, crap. <laughs> okay, shark, you be friendly. And so will I. Um, 
that looks like netting. Uh, we'll go up there in a second because that's where that purple stuff is. Hey, friendo. I know you're dead, but is anything really dead on this island? Everything's all messed up, I'll tell you that. What is that? Oh, it's an anchor. I, for some reason, don't like that rock structure. That's in Are those bones? Boy, I got sidetracked. Okay. Mm. Oh, it's a whale. Okay. It's a, it's a tiny whale. I can barely describe what I have witnessed today. That old fool Alex suddenly went insane. He started stuffing his mouth with rocks. Mm. And kept doing so until his cheeks were completely torn. Ooh. We had to tie him down. If you're reading this, send help. There's definitely something wrong with this guy. Not a fan. This small whale. I recognize this boat. It was made by an artist to represent our greatest catch. How did it end up here? This was meant to be completed by the end of December. Mm. It's still September. Nah, here it's not. What's on that? Oh, it's a nest. Oh, hey. Despite his fear about the island, he would often come here fishing some very colorful fish. I remember finding myself quite disturbed as I watched him stuff his mouth with their raw meat. You can still see it over the trees there a little bit. I think it's on its way to its friend. Oh. Oh. Oh, okay. It's happening. Every man for himself. They all started losing their minds, like what happened to Thanos. He ate his own fingers and cut his eyelids. Yeah. He was screaming something about being ready to receive the gift of the Watcher. Oh, that's creepy. I've lost track of time. I don't know what the date is anymore, nor the hour. The sun isn't moving. Why is the sun not moving? I noticed that. If you're reading this, then I hope you end up here too. If you're reading this, then I hope you end up here too? What do you mean you hope I end up here too? That's pretty jank. Anyway, um, The Watcher, when he said The Watcher, there's a movie called The Watcher in the Woods. It's a very good movie. It's a very old movie. Well, I mean, it's not that old, but I think it was like 80s. I don't really know when it was made, but it's a good movie. I highly recommend it. We're gonna go. Oh, 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 oh. There. Ah! Hello. Ah! All right. Okay, 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 okay. Hmm. Yeah, that spooked me a little bit more than I thought it was going to. It didn't do anything for a couple of hot seconds, and so I thought everything was fine. It was not fine. <laughs> okay, I can't tell where they're coming from. Oh. Hmm. Purple thing is over here. Oh, you're a meteor. Just like classified. Holy shit sticks. We'll touch it in just a second. I just want to check out our area no all right well I guess we're gonna go touch it bad things are gonna happen hey! <gasps> I knew it is Cthulhu an interdimensional creature is that what he's supposed to be yeah come close enough with the strange meteorite okay well Yup. Okay, now what? <sighs> so I'm a dumb. So I'm, um, I'm a I'm a big dumb. I didn't even realize that it was right there. I didn't like the creaking noise it made, but yeah, it was right there the whole time. So I did look it up and I did find it, and I'm happy that I found it. But I was totally oblivious to it even being in there at all. So, whoops. 
but we found it so now we can make progress and I'm glad I looked it up because I would have continued to look around this beach and not find anything because I would never have thought to come back and look in that so I'm glad I looked it up and now we can progress because this is the side where that creepy blue dude was Hmm. Creepy. Okay. <laughs> sprint? Um, why did you tell me to sprint? Are we gonna have to run from something soon? This place feels <laughs> like it was always a part of me. Mm -hmm. As if it has taken a hold of me and won't let go. Another foot in the sand, but this time sink deeper beneath the shore. Day 30. Elliot is trying to put together the broken parts on a boat we found. If he manages to build it, then we might have a chance of escaping this place. We have to try at least. There's only three of us left now in our crew. We can't afford to waste any more time here. As if time exists in this place. I think I'm starting to lose my mind. I can hear my breath after a screeching sound pierces my ears. If you are reading this, then don't look for us. Hmm. Okay. Hey. Seagull, hey. Okay, there's so much to unpack in just this moment. First off, when the little octopus dude showed up, that scared me. Secondly, I noticed that there's a body parts on, like, pitchforks and pikes. So, that's another problem in itself. Good God. Oh my God. Okay, we'll look at that in just a second. Um... Oh, there's that boat with that creepy person. What the hell are you? We'll touch you in a second. Okay, let's look at all these things. Okay. Oh, what are you? Uh, we do not dare to walk the shore when the night comes. Something in the dark seemed to follow us in great speed. We hid inside the small cave. We had to stay there for the rest of of the night we began to fear that we are no longer safe on this island we have to leave but seems everything works against us it's long tentacle legs we're gonna ignore the splashing sound um seemed to be very strong a boulder before it shattered into pieces with a single strike jesus my other half mind tells me i should stay behind and study them and the other half tells me I should leave now. John, one of the crew members, found a camera. If we get it to work, I should. we should try taking a few pictures. <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay, anything to read here? Nothing else! Oh, okay. Well, I thought... Let's get a gander. Okay, there's an arm. What is this? Nothing. Nothing and nothing. Hello. It's like a creature going, bah! It's like a pterodactyl. <sighs> Ooh. It has an eye in the middle and it looks like an organic star-like figure. It does look like a star. Ooh, hey, look, yeah, an eye. Okay. Now what? We're getting awfully close to that boat that we saw that creature on. It looked like, um, a person. <laughs> Is that a plane? That's a plane right there in the top right. Is that not a plane? That looks like a plane. Ooh, is this like a Bermuda Triangle type of thing? Ooh. Oh. Oh, God, see that symbol again. Oh, this is a picture of us, our daughter, and our dog. Oh. Look at that dog. He looks nervous. What is this? A 
Looking upon my daughter's toy gave me some sort of happiness. Yet I can't take my mind off the idea she's been taken by one of those creatures. Oh. But, wait a minute, I'm so sorry. Didn't she die long ago? The... The hell's that seagull doing? I thought she died of pneumonia. Was that not true? Did one of the creatures take her after she died? Ah, there's another defying seagull. Okay. Hey, how are you doing this? How are you doing that? Like, I'll never tell. Oh, no. Oh, hell no. That's a cave with weird rock thingies. Oh, we are about to have a problem. It's not my fault. A person has already died here. Jay spoke about a shadow whispering between the rocks. We can't stay on this island anymore. We have to leave now. Was that the same whispering that I heard when we were going to the obelisk? Learn what happened to the previous survivors by reading their dot 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 notes, I'm assuming. Okay, so do we have all of the notes? Oh, we do! Okay, cool. Accomplished. <sighs> I just got the maddest chills just now of having to go through this cave. Something bad's about to go down. Oh. Oh. There's a body. Okay, so something tells me that that's a bad idea. First thing that I looked at um, with the way that shape is, I now know that there are two bodies that look like mer people, but it looked like Anubis for a hot second. Um, I don't know where to go to first. I'm assuming, I'm assuming this way first because it shows the path first. Oh, solitude oh and God. peace is what a soul seeks after being free. One, two, three. Did they die in vain? It appears they were murdered. What a horrible way to find solitude. Yeah. Yeah. The whole story is very interesting, but I'm also a little scared. Is that a cool camera? Oh, did they get a picture of it? Crouch. Oh! 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 My God! What is that? Oh, that looks like a, like a fish rib cage. Oh my gosh. So two creature humanoid thingies killed them. People now would say that's photoshopped. Hmm. Okay, well, we're going to go towards the boat and probably regret it immediately. Oh, we can jump now. My dude, that is so cool. So, do I need to jump? Oh, there's a thingy that popped up. Why did you do that to me? Ooh. Oh, really? We can't go all the way that? That's upsetting. I would have really liked to do that. Oh, can I not get back? Oh, all right. Well, that works too, I guess. <laughs> hey, bud. <laughs> Excuse me. I'm gonna I'm gonna get around you real quick. Oh, nice little grill thing going on. A little map. A potential jump scare, maybe. Oh. Yeah, that's not good. Oh, so maybe we had to go here first to go here first. That's a creepy ass doll. That's so creepy. Do not fall for it. Do we know our dude's name? Do we know his name? Do not fall for it, my guy. <sighs> Dad. <laughs> okay, don't hurt me. Don't hurt me. Don't hurt me. Don't hurt me. 
Ah, shit. Oh, shit. Oh, we're gonna die, aren't we? Just like everybody else. Oh, it's a seagull! I saw something moving over there! Okay, okay, okay. Okay, okay. What's gonna happen? It's bullshit. Is it gonna get all dark, too? <laughs> yes, it is. It totally is. Okay, what's gonna happen? Something's gonna grab us, isn't it? Okay, I'm gonna- I'm gonna call it. Oh, look at their pointy faces! I wish I could zoom in. I mean, <laughs> editor me can zoom in. <laughs> Non-editor me just has to deal with it. Wouldn't that be creepy if you can see somebody on the lighthouse? Like, somebody standing there just, like, looking at stuff like we have been. And it's just, like, a continuing cycle no matter what we do. There's always somebody new doing the same steps that we are. How trippy would that be? Okay, well, something tells me I shouldn't walk in the middle. Oh, something tells me I have to walk in the middle. <sighs> All right. All right, we're just going to go for it. Go for it. Go for it. Eh, 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 eh. Ah, 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 ah. Look at their pointy faces. And their creepy ass tails. We are so going to die. Ah. Oh, that's not what I was expecting. Oh, that's not what I was expecting at all. Oh, it's like the universe. Okay, now what? What do we do now? You see your golden back. I can help you. What the you will have to do something for me first. Um. I'll do anything. Don't say that. Anything to see her face again. No, don't say that! Oh, no. What have you done? You'll do anything to see her face again. Oh my gosh, she is selling your soul to Cthulhu! Oh, bruh! Okay, okay, okay. Oh. Oh. I can hear voices. <gasps> what the hell are you? Oh, hi. Hello. What are you? Oh, there's little ones everywhere. What can I do with this? Can I do anything? No? Okay. I'm just panicking for no reason! Look at the little blobby things. What do you do? Hey, buddy. This looks like a creature from, like, Bloodborne or something. Like that weird spider creature, or the creatures that hang on the walls. Um... 